Hey there, in today's video, I'm gonna show you that you do not need to put anything inside of a white shirt when you're working with sublimation or any shirt. So let's get started. To uh, confirm what I said about it not going through, it's only going to get on the front part of the um, shirt. Not You will see it in the, on the inside, but it will not bleed through. So if you're one of those people that uses butcher paper, parchment paper, cardboard, what have you, I challenge you to try without. Several of these shirts happen to be the thinnest shirts that I've seen on the market. I don't like those, but anyway, even those didn't, didn't bleed through or transfer to the other side of the shirt. And this is the inside. See the seam on the inside? Let me get to the flag. Sorry, I'm kind of trying to one-hand it here. So you'll see it, but it won't penetrate through, all the way through. And I know a lot of people use parchment paper or butcher paper on the inside, but it will not go through. You'll see it, but it will never go through. So save your butcher paper, your parchment paper. There you go. When working with sublimation, you're supposed to be using light pressure anyway. But regardless, I always use light to medium pressure. So either way, I hope that helps. That's all I have for now. Until next time.